a liberal arts education values how you come to learn more than necessarily what you learn. A lot of thought has been put into education at Reed. It's hard, but it's in the end, it's so, so worthwhile. This isn't a place where people come if they're kind of half interested in their education. They share that real courageousness and a lot of personal responsibility for their learning. There's a real intellectual excitement. Students often start college thinking that they are going to learn a lot of things that are known already. And what is incredibly exciting is that most things are not known. I'm looking at how animals do in response to low oxygen conditions. The curriculum has a very intentional shape. Most of your classes are taught in a discussion format. The professor doesn't lecture in those conferences. The professor really engages the students in this common discussion. Most readies have a, an ability, at least, to change their opinion. You know, they're willing to listen. I think we all have to learn how to engage in a civil discussion. It's just a wonderful experience, too, in terms of like the social atmosphere. There's a spirit of collaboration. Part of that might be because of the lack of emphasis on grades. The grading process is one of the best parts of reading. Papers never come back with a grade. They only come back with comments. That reclaims all of that energy and space and gives it back to learning. If you want to say, you know, this is a great paper, you've got to say why it's a great paper. One of the things that I find really striking about Reed students is how much they take care of each other. They're careful with each other in class. They're attentive to each other outside of class. People are pulling together, little operations and clubs and stuff. So hi, this is me, and this is my friend Vikram, and right now we're at Cheese Club, and we're gonna eat a bunch of different kinds of cheese and learn about the cheese. It's raining outside right now. Apparently we're going to some kind of temperate rainforest here in Oregon. I've never been to a rainforest before, and it's our last bio activity of the year. They should definitely do split screen for this. This is going to be weird to put side to side. <laughs> My favorite place on campus is probably the canyon. It's like 28 acres of wetland. A little island of kind of nature and tranquility. When you're done, it's a three minute walk to class. It's a jewel even of like the greater Portland area. It's really a very interesting and inspiring place to live. Students have a lot of freedom. What the faculty try and do is treat them as colleagues and peers. Faculty and students have really close relationships. The first and the last question we always ask is, what does this do for the educational experience of the students? Reed has given me a perspective and, a, and certain habits of thinking and habits of living. When students leave here, they know that there's no place like this. Uh, I spent the last week like saying goodbye to a lot of people. Though I know I'll like see them again, I don't think we're ever going to be in this place altogether again. And that, that's what it's about.